Sweeney, it takes some balls to do what you did. Luckily, you got him. And <laughs> I love your joke about Jess's hair. At least Jess has the audacity to cut off what she hates about herself. Okay. You guys are both girthy in different ways, and that's fun. That's fun. Fucking amazing battle, tops to bottoms, and... Dude, and please, please he's canceled. Two... Yeah. <laughs> Who gives a fuck? I, uh, I don't have a career to begin yeah, I, with. I, I just got dressed up, and Hunter could not have dressed down even more. It is... <laughs> is there paint on your pants, Hunter? Yeah. 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 yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you just came from remodeling your old uh, house. Yeah, yeah, it's both read a lot during that battle, which was nice, made it feel academic. Um, <laughs> yeah, I don't think either of you graduated high school, which is fun. You're two different kinds of dropouts, and that's for the crowd to decide. This uh, was a fun battle between the rock gym leader and a Snorlax. <laughs> It's crazy that Roast Battle Chicago had to go all the way to London to find a black man to do the show. <laughs> Congrats on uh, the matching outfits. That was cute. That was cool. <laughs> you guys look like you're on a dance team for the fat people of America. That's good. That's good. <laughs> your name's XL, but you guys both wear that. That's appropriate. I'm glad we could get both of you here. Glad you got your shifts off from catcalling out to Paul's campus. <laughs> No, this is good. I think the winner of this battle should be the new face of the Restore Hair Billboards. <laughs> Get Brian Erlacher out of there, okay? This was a fun battle between the PTA and the PE teacher who touches kids. This is a fun legal case between downtown Chicago and the fucking suburbs. This was... Yeah, that was a great battle between a bunch of ice road truckers. That was good. <laughs> you guys look like Sarah Palin's campaign team. <laughs> You guys look like you'd be cast in like a Dolly Parton music video, you know? <laughs> like she's the powerful protagonist and he's the deadbeat dad she's running away from. <laughs> I will fucking die for Ruslan's citizenship. <laughs> dude, dude, every time he gets on stage, I'm like, there's a country fatter than America? <laughs> Keep them coming! <laughs> How do we import these people? Dude, Max, you look like Captain America just started doing side quests. <laughs> Dude, this was so much fucking fun. Classic battle, fat versus frat. This was great. This is fun. My I can't tell if Cody's Hispanic or hates Hispanics. <laughs> Come on, man. Mark, you look like a Republican senator who's hiding the fact that they're gay. <laughs> nice. Crowd Boys versus QAnon. We got to see it. <laughs> Uh, two different kind of bombers, appropriately. Uh, <laughs> this was fun. I like you guys kept reading off your notes because I was like, holy shit, they can read. Uh, Wild Philly, dressed like you got kicked out of Margaritaville for trying to fuck a dolphin. <laughs> this was hard to watch. I, uh, <laughs> what is this, my act? Um, <laughs> don't laugh at that, Tito. <laughs> I'm afraid the winner's gonna relapse. I'm <laughs> What's on the line here? Xanax and a drink? What's going on? <laughs> Keep it going for Snow White's Eighth Dwarf. Yes. <laughs> Slutty. She didn't make the film. Disney didn't want her. <laughs> Neither did her family. Now she does this. Okay. <laughs> Looked like Bernie supporters versus Trump supporters up here. That was... <laughs> You have golden retriever energy, and you look like you fight dogs. <laughs> <laughs> You're both Michael Vick fans. <laughs> you guys both look like Red Bull athletes. I don't know how to describe it. I, uh, <laughs> it's like an X Games meets Special Olympics collab going up. Uh, I oh, thought gay guys like... were supposed to be really funny. I, uh, <laughs> I felt like You're Riley's straight? jokes were. <laughs> I felt like Riley's jokes were trying to hit a word count. <laughs> Every joke of yours felt like it was like a fucking word problem on a math test. <laughs> I was like, I don't care, just get hit by the train already. <laughs> fucking, holy shit, uh, that was fun, man. Matt, great job telling jokes, Riley, great job reading them. I, uh... <laughs> that looks like a fucking 7-Eleven fight is going on stage. <laughs> That's fun. What, like you haven't seen one before? <laughs> <laughs> Greg looks like if Mario ate Bowser. That's, uh, <laughs> and Brody looks like anorexic warrior. The battle of the ironic shirts, that's fun. <laughs> Cody, I sure hope you don't work at NASA. Andrew, I sure hope they don't let you around animals. 
I don't know how to describe this, but you two both feel like you're like Napoleon Dynamite extras. <laughs> Bob looks like a proud boy, but Jason's dressed like one. That's right. Demo the skulls on your shirt. What are you celebrating? Day of the Deadbeat? That's Bob looks like a Border Patrol agent. You look like the guy who would snitch on the rest of his party. It's a fun battle between two different kinds of mechanics, you know? One charges you a full price, the other one gives you a deal. Oh, oh yeah, who took your catalytic converter? Shit, that's my uncle's work. Yeah, I'm from Iowa. He's from Nebraska. So now you two look the most inbred on this show. And that's, <laughs> I hope they both graduate. What 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 subject is that notebook for? That's my that's my question. He's, 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 he's studying ionic particles and halfway through he's like, Zach, this is a little Jewish bitch. <laughs> so fucking TA has to read that and be like, dude, you gotta go to the office, okay? <laughs> This is the third manifesto I found this week. <laughs> this, is a, this is a great battle between two Six Flags employees. <laughs> we have the new guy and the guy who's been there way too long. They're like, hey man, stop staring at the kids. <laughs> this was fun, dude. TJ, your mustache says you tie kids to railroad tracks. <laughs> And AJ, you look like the kid he ties to the railroad track. <laughs> AJ, you look like you sell pills. TJ, you look like you put them in women's drinks. Oh. <laughs> Andrew, Andrew said QAnon, they were like, yay. And then he said conspiracy, and they were like, well, now. <laughs> we got us on the first part, so. <laughs> If Ben was a football player, were you his coach that spent too much time in the locker room? Uh, keep going for the Scooby-Doo cast from Velma, everybody. Cheekies! <laughs> I gotta find my glasses. No, seriously, I'm reading off my notes. I gotta find my glasses. <laughs> You guys know The Bear, the movie that show The Bear? Yeah. You guys look like body doubles for The Bear. <laughs> like The Bear if it was shot at Burger King. <laughs> yes, chef. Yes, yes chef. chef. I'm of age, yes, chef. <laughs> you guys both look like two different kinds of youth faster. <laughs> cool and like friendly dad, you know? <laughs> one's Baptist, one's Lutheran. They're both touching the kids. <laughs> Excessively. Dude, you were so, like you were like tagging up his jokes, being like, "Hey, you know what? You are right. I do kind of suck." Like, <laughs> like you're like a drug dealer. You're a supportive dad. <laughs> you're like, sell that weed. Come on. Adam started jumping on the stage. I got nervous for the stage. <laughs> Cody, you look uh -huh. like a truck driver if he absorbed the Michelin tire man. <laughs> uh, this was a fun battle between country and cunt. That was. <laughs> Alex, you really Jewish? Yes. All right, that's gonna help my career. That's good. <laughs> Eric found out there was a Jew from New York on stage. He's like, holy shit, industry's here tonight? <laughs> oh my God. So I wanna point out that Nico just looks like a bisexual Eric Emerson. <laughs> this was like a battle between both sides of the autism spectrum. <laughs> Neither of you should be allowed within 500 feet of a school. Uh, I go into an every day, Matthew. I know, and that's a problem. It's concerning. <laughs> This is why we should pay teachers more so bad teachers aren't hired, <laughs> okay? Kevin, Donald, that was fun. All right, is he a member of QAnon? Yes! Oh. <laughs> All right, out of bare metal, he hates women. Kevin's a misogynist. Cancel him on his own show, folks. That's where we got him. Wrap him up. We got you. You're never doing your own show ever again, you moron. <laughs> Ethan's like, I personally enjoyed Catholic school. I was like, yeah, you were fucking your teachers. Of course you were. <laughs> you were sought after. No! 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 no. That's false! To the highest degree! The yeah, doesn't he look like a choir boy, though? <laughs> he goes, I'm a teacher. I'm like, you're passing it on, dude. That's disgusting. You know, I, I, I have a lot... <laughs> Um, excuse me. Order in the court. I'm, <laughs> I am the mob judge in here. I'm gonna say. I, I, I. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. okay. I'm gonna say something profound here. Fucking everybody chill out, okay? <laughs> Don't go to school tomorrow. <laughs> All right. Fucking. Yeah. He's a man. A man. No. We are gonna get the worst pop quiz tomorrow. <laughs> pop, pop, pop. 
I, I, I think it's great that you like wrote your jokes out, even though I'm pretty sure you can't read. That was, <laughs> <laughs> he, he would look at the paper and be like, "Oh, I don't know any of this." <laughs> Someone pick him up, please. Tell me there's just hieroglyphs on there, please. <laughs> it's a picture book. It's like written out. It's like Confederate flag and then a picture of a waist. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Dylan, sorry about your sister. For what it's worth, you have her voice. Uh, <laughs> how can you be insecure about your body when your face has leprosy? That's fucking. <laughs> That's funny. Dude, Brent, look, you look like you were kicked out of the lumberyard for tending other men's wood. <laughs> this is fun. This is a cool battle between the full spectrum of Florida Georgia Line fans. That's. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't look like you'd go to a Mumford and Sons concert. Him for Mumford, you to fuck the Sons. <laughs> the highlight of that battle for me was afterwards when I said makes noise, Bob started clapping with his own belly. <laughs> it's like Shaggy versus Fred. <laughs> the winner gets to get pegged by Velma. This is. I don't know. If you guys want to support them, they will be selling edibles outside. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, this is great. You two look like you're on a Minecraft server together. <laughs> hey man, what a star stood at night. We even got two extras from Yellowstone here. That's... <laughs> you guys look like those early 2000 JCPenney catalogs. <laughs> That's... Uh, at least I'm pretty, though. I mean, someone's got to be on the stage, you know? Uh, <laughs> Matt's uh, right there, okay? Uh, yeah. <laughs> yes! Uh, yes! I've never gotten a compliment on this show. <laughs> That's right, I'm the hot comic on the show. <laughs> Never forget that, Internet. It was Rage Against the Machine versus The Machine. <laughs> now we know who would win in a fight between Aquaman in the movies and Aquaman in the comics. <laughs> uh, if we get my t-shirts, technically we have three black comics on the stage right now. <laughs> uh, you guys look like you're in town for all of Palooza because you thought it was Riot Fest. <laughs> Kevin, you look like Johnny Sins, but without the Johnny and all the Sins. <laughs> My favorite part of Jeremy's set was watching the other two Bamas secretly do vapes under the table. That is, <laughs> that is fun. They're just ripping vapes under the set. It was no secret. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Dan is flexible. He's not sucking his own dick. He's just ripping a jewel, and that's fun. That's, uh, oh, it's I'm like not... old Kanye fans versus new Kanye fans. <laughs> Can you, can you hold up your note, your notepad? <laughs> they can see it. They're all <laughs> Before the battle, we, we told him, we said, hey man, can't read off your phone. He goes, is this better? And I'm like, somehow that's way worse. <laughs> <laughs> I totally totally like forgot what was going on. I'm sorry. I've been too busy running the door like an idiot, you know? <laughs> that's my big credit. You may recognize me from the door five minutes ago, you know? <laughs> yeah, pretty famous. You've all seen me, you know? <laughs> I was out today handing out flyers next to the blue line, just getting sweaty for this, you know? <laughs> this show really is my blood, sweat, and tears, but more so just my tears. You know, that's... <laughs>